people think I'm a big deal around here because I throw touchdown passes. And I am. <laughs> but I wouldn't have a field to do it on if it wasn't for this guy. So this Saturday, we're dedicating our big game to our inspiration, Corey Matthews. <laughs> so here to introduce the man of the hour is his brother, Eric. What's your last name? It's Matthews. Wow, same as your brother's. That's <laughs> weird, huh? <clears throat> okay, I'd like to start off with a mega big Patriots hello to all my fellow students, especially you, Christine Wingate. I see you looking at me. <laughs> Corey Matthews. Corey Matthews. Corey Matthews. Now, what can I say except, well, last week, Stephanie and I broke up, so I am currently single and available. Call me. Corey Matthews, a hero. All right. So, uh, have you heard of the Lord of the Dance? Huh? It's me. Do you even know what quantum physics is? Um, hi. That's what they're gonna teach me. If I knew what quantum physics was, I would have taken quantum physics too. Now, wouldn't I? Have you looked at this? It's gibberish. It's not gibberish. You're gibberish. It's new and exciting, just like me. So nuts to you, you jerks. Uh, excuse me there, Professor. Um, my friends seem to think that I've taken on an impossible load with quantum physics and that I'm gonna have some trouble understanding the course material. Well. I could give you a brief synopsis and you can decide for yourself. On the first day, we start off with and then we focus on Excuse me, we have a staff meeting. I know that they're closed, but I, 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 I told you I made a terrible mistake. I accept full responsibility for that. Now, will you please help me? Son, did you know that one in three new students won't make it through their freshman year? Why are you telling me that? Because college isn't for everyone, son. And if you find just simple course selection so overwhelming, well, perhaps you need to consider if it's for you. Look, you're my guidance counselor. I get in the trouble and you guide me out. That's going to be our relationship, yes? This is college. The real world. The relationship you're talking about, it doesn't exist here. I'm sorry. Bye bye All right, first of all, this is not a trial, so let's not make a big courtroom drama out of it. <laughs> Jonathan Cumberland for the defense. <laughs> ah, this is better. Shh. Sorry. You don't sound sorry. You sound loud. Shh. Thanks. Now they hate me too. Shut up! You shut up. And you shut up. Everybody shut up! Oh, I hate college. Pressure. The pressure, it's killing me. Hey, you got a button on that thing that gets her naked? Yeah. Hey, 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 yeah. hey! You don't talk about my Rachel that way, all right? I created her in my own image. She's like my daughter. Watch what I do to her now. Boys, you've already apologized. I mean, this isn't necessary. Mmm, love that Gouda. Oh, hang on. Uh, listen, there's a slight change in our first ever engaged Christmas plans. See, Sean's bunking in my room, so the sex is off. Uh, Santa, Mrs. C, Elf Boy. Yeah, I just got word that a uh, busload of children from St. Mary's just arrived. Now, these are children without parents and no money at all. So, you know what that means. Yeah that they're not going to buy anything, so get rid of them as fast as you can. Yeah, our lives really were turned upside down by this oh, one. Dude, weren't they? Yeah. I'm telling you, man. But you know something? I realized something after I moved out of the apartment. What? It was the competition. The competition that was so exciting. Ah, yeah, it was. Mm. Yeah. What? what? Yeah, I, I won that one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> won what? Won you. 
I mean that you know, I didn't I didn't won you. I meant I won you. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, look, I, I really just came over here. Now, see, here's the thing. Have you ever really gotten caught up in the spirit of Christmas so much so that you want to steal? <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody. How you doing? <laughs> this is... It's okay. Come on in. This is Tommy. Hi. Well, hi, Tommy. Do you have my 75-bit power drill? <laughs> the problem is Jack. I mean, ever since Rachel moved in, we've had this unspoken competition between the two of us. Uh, sometimes, at night, I imagine he gets killed. <laughs> <laughs> Sex is the last thing we should be doing. <laughs> you are wrong. <laughs> you just are. <laughs> but I'm looking very forward to spending all of the next few days together, getting to know you better than I ever have before. <laughs> well, if I would have known we were just going to do that, I would have bought the flannel pajamas with the feet <laughs> instead of the silk pajamas and the silk blanket and these silk sheets. <laughs> Dearly beloved, we are gathered here to join Jessica and Edward in holy matrimony. This whole thing is so out of our league. They'll it probably get him some day. private jet and honeymoon in Tahiti. In some private romantic villa on some nude beach. Hoi! You just saw the bride. Ooh, yeah. Can you imagine the kind of honeymoon they're going to have? Yeah. Could you just imagine? No. <laughs> <laughs> if there's anyone here present who might give just cause as to why those two should not be joined in holy matrimony, speak now or forever hold your peace. What are you doing? Spasm. <laughs> Eric, in a world that is not run by savages, there is such a thing as decorum. Now, decorum would suggest that a gentleman allow a lady to resolve an old relationship before he engages her in a new one. Yes, but see, you're already in a new relationship. You're in a triangle, Feeney. And take it from somebody who's been in a triangle before. He who hesitates is lost. Rachel! Eric, we really want you to come. Well, how do you expect me to go back to the place where I had my heart ripped out of my chest and thrown around the room like it was a, a, like a, like a Nerf heart? <laughs> I want you to forget about everything that's happened between us and remember that we're friends. And I want you to come to our party because it's for friends. Will you be making tater tots? <laughs> I'll make tater tots. Oh, well, then I'll be there. <laughs> I'm so in love with her. <laughs> oh, Josh, get cold, buddy. Oh, who's the little one? That's Joshua. He's so cute. How old is he? Mm, months or something, I don't know. Uh, look at me, though. I'm Eric. You know, there's nothing sweeter than a father with his new baby. Well, sure there is. A father, his new baby, and his new baby's girlfriend. What about your wife? Dead. What are you doing later? <laughs> are you, no, I'm, yeah, I'm all that he's got in this world. Hey, Eric. Me too, I'm a mom and dad. Hey, all right, great. Cup of coffee? Come on. Did oh, you miss your mommy? Did I? Did I miss my mommy? Of course I miss my mommy. Come here. Oh, I missed my daddy too, didn't I, big guy? All right, back off. All right, all right. Have you met my new friend? This is, um... Dana. Dana. Hello. Hey, Dana. You have an adorable grandson. What? <laughs> oh, uh, yes, yes. Yes, we do. Thank you very much. Good luck. Oh, he's using our child to pick up women. Disgusting. I'm, I'm going to have a talk with him. See what I made there. <laughs> great, great party, Rachel. We're having a great time. Really? Wow, I thought that whole honesty game might have ruined the evening. Ah, on the contrary. Honesty is the only way to go for a healthy relationship. If you'll notice, only the honest couples are left here. Yeah, the bullet hurt. <laughs> But I saved the president's life, so I think it was worth it. Eric doesn't count. And 
I'm Batman. <laughs> you see, Sean, all it took was you and me to get them to settle their differences. Corey and Sean forever. Best friends. Best friends forever. Corey, why are you looking at me like that? Corey, wait. Oh. Oh. Corey! You have to go. Shoving everyone down the elevator shaft. Guess who's next? Rachel! Rachel! Angela, come on. Everybody's doing it. Doing what? This. 